All right. Hey guys, welcome to our new coach call. If you were not able to make it, we do it every first and third Tuesday of the month. Um, hopefully going forward, we'll have some more coaches presenting. So you guys don't always have to listen to me. Um, I apologize. My voice is really raspy. It's been like that since I came back from summit and even during summit, I think I'm just still super exhausted. If you have any questions during the call, use the chat feature. Um, that way I, they'll pop up and Emily will help me answer any calls. So let's go ahead and get started. Let me introduce myself to you guys in case you do not know me. I am Ashley, obviously. Um, some of you on this call, you are my personally sponsored coaches. I signed up with Beachbody in January of 2013. So it's been a little bit, about two and a half years now. Um, I am what created Team Fire to Get Fit. It started with me and only me. And now we are 250 plus strong, which is amazing. I was a 2014 premier coach. Only 79 coaches out of 300,000 can say they hit premier. Um, I could not have done that without my team, without you guys. If you watch the live broadcast of the closing sessions at Summit, you got to see me prance across the stage as I prayed and prayed that I would not trip over my wedges because I'm clumsy and I would totally do something like that in front of 25,000 people, but I didn't, so yay, go me. Um, I am a two-star diamond in my first business center, where that means I have two diamonds underneath me. I am a one-star diamond in my second business center. Once you hit two-star, you get to open up another CBC. I, my husband is a diamond and currently going one star qualifying. I have a total of six diamonds underneath me. I have 80 personally sponsored coaches. Um, my story started with Turbo Fire. I lost 38 pounds with Turbo Fire and over 35 inches. Since then, I have officially lost 50 pounds with Beach Body Workouts. I've completed Turbo Fire, Les Mills Pump, 21 Day Fix. I have every workout program under the moon. It's kind of ridiculous, minus size. It's like the one I don't own. And I retired at the age of 27. I am currently the only full-time coach on Team Beachbody, or not Team Beachbody, Team Fire to Get Fit. See, I'm exhausted, um, which is awesome. It's exciting. Lots of coaches are working towards it. And one thing I want to say before we even get the call starting, you do not have to do this full-time. So many coaches will listen to me like, Ashley, I don't want to do this full-time. Totally okay. Like, we've got coaches going for, like, their PhDs and master's. They're not planning on quitting what they're doing to do Beachbody full-time, but you can still make a very good income and have a very good business and still do what you love and still do Beachbody at the same time. So let me just preface with that. All right, let's move on to the meat of the call. First thing you need to do when you become a coach is, hello, you need to leave the closet. Like, you can't stay in the closet as a Beachbody coach and expect people are going to come to you. How are they going to know you're a coach? You got to be proud. You got to share why you became a coach. Share with the world. Like you're doing a disservice to your friends and family by not sharing because guess what? There's 330,000 other beach body coaches. And if you don't share with the world that you're a beach body coach, your friends are going to go find another beach body coach. I hear so often in our team page saying, so and so signed up with my friend. I'm like, did you ask them to become a coach? Did they know you were a coach? Well, no. Well, of course, so-and-so went to your, the other person because they don't know you're a coach. Why did you join? Why do you love Beachbody? That's why you want, that's what you want to do, share when you become a Beachbody coach. I never want to see somebody be like, hey, I'm a Beachbody coach, order through me, here's my link. If I ever see somebody post their link in a status and be like, hey, knock, knock, anybody home, take the link down. So big no-no, like write this down, asterisk it, put giant stars, clouds, whatever you got to do on your notes. Don't ever put your link in your status. That's the one thing you take away from this call. I'm totally okay with it. Um, so here's an example of Brittany Woods um, when she became out as a coach. And so one, I always use an example because it's perfect. So for those on the phone, I'll read it for you guys. Some of you may or may not know that this week I started a journey towards a better, a better healthier life. I've set goals to lose weight, eat a cleaner diet, and inspire those around me. To keep myself accountable, I became a Beachbody coach and joined a challenge group filled with individuals who have the same goals. If you're all interested in joining me, please let me know. I would love it if we could make this positive changes together. So she shared why she became a coach. She shared like what her goals are. That's what you want to do. That's how you want to. Sh that's how you want to come out as a coach. And if you want to send it to your upline and be like, "Hey, does this sound okay?" Do that. So if you're on this call and you've been a coach longer than like two days and you have not announced you're a coach. Put giant asterisks and arrows and bubbles and hearts around them and say, I got to do this now. So let's talk about the three vital behaviors because you'll hear us talk about it a lot. The three vital behaviors are like the three laws of Beachbody. So what are they? Invite, invite, invite. Be proof of the product. 
and personal development. So I'm going to dive into those a little bit more. So what does invite mean? It really means you're just connecting, connecting, connecting daily. Like every single day you should be adding to your network. You can't grow if you're not adding to your network because what's going to happen is you're eventually going to, you're going to run out of warm leads and warm leads are those that you've already been friends with. So I've been doing this for two and a half years. I've run out of warm leads. I ran out of warm leads like my first six months. So what does that mean? It means I either give up and I quit or I add new people and I find new people. That's exactly what I did. I add at least five to six new friends a day, whether they're old high school friends, whether they're people I went to college with, whether we're friends of friends and we don't have college or we don't have beach body coaches together. I'm posting on social media. I'm adding on Instagram. I'm growing my like page. You have to invite and connect daily. So basically like what Beachbody says about inviting is invite as many piece of, many people as possible every day. Invite people to join your challenge group. Have the courage to invite everyone you come in contact with. Invite and then invite some more. You got to invite. It's super scary in the beginning, but once you get used to it, it becomes super easy. A coach I would love to give an example of, she's not even my coach, she's Emily Albrego's coach, Ashley Wetley. In her first 30 days as a coach, I'm pretty sure, Emily, help me out by like throwing up some fingers, like 300 people, like her entire friends list. Yeah, she was just like, screw it, I'm going for it. And she invited her entire friends list. I'm pretty sure she got like 250 no's in the first 30 days, but she was like, I'm gonna roll with it and I'm gonna make it happen. You're doing a disservice to your friends and family if you're not inviting them to this thing. If I wouldn't have invited Emily to this, then she wouldn't have invited her coaches to this. If I wouldn't have invited my personally sponsored coaches, there's so many that I can't even name, then they wouldn't have been invited to this. I had a coach that literally came to me today and was like, I'm so happy I found you on Instagram and I reached out to you and that you talked about this coaching thing with me because in the first 14 days of being a coach, it's already changed my life. If you don't invite them, someone else will. That's like my echo system that I'm doing right there. Seriously, you got to invite. It's super scary, but I promise it's so worth it. And never, let me just add this in, never think like, oh, this person won't join me. I never thought in a million years, Emily Albrecht would become a coach. Like never in a million years. And I invited her to a sneak peek and I was like, eh, why not? And then she joined and I was like, huh. And she's like friends with my husband. So like we kind of knew each other. And now she's like one of the top coaches on the team. So don't think that like, just because you don't think they'd be a coach that you shouldn't invite them because you never know what will happen. Let's talk about proof of the product. Proof of the product means you're using the products. You cannot be a coach and not work out. You cannot be a coach and not use Shakeology. And I know not everybody likes Shakeology and you just got to work through it, but you got to use the products. So on my screen, it's like proof of like pictures and you have to share them. Use the fitness programs. Use Shakeology. Be a walking success story. Um, before I left for a summit, I went to the nail salon and I took my little Shakeology cup that says Shakeology on the side. I had like four people asking like, so you drink Shakeology. Why do you drink Shakeology? What does it do for you? You got to be a walking success story because people are going to notice. They're going to be like, you look good. What have you been doing? Oh, you know, just the 21 day fix. Share the videos. They may like, you may think you look silly. Like I shared a size video and I looked ridiculous. Like I looked like I was drunk times 10 and had no rhythm whatsoever because I don't, but I did it. And it showed people that I'm like human and they were interested in it and they got to know the program. Be proof of the product every single day, at least five times a day. Share your workout, share your sweaty selfies. I always say taking selfies is our fourth vital behavior. Like it should be like in our vital behaviors because like, Face it, what we do as coaches is we take selfies all day, every day. Please do not share pictures of your Shakeology bag. Anybody can do that. Be creative, like share a recipe, share yourself shaking it up, like share yourself drinking it. Be creative. And the last one is personal development. I'll be honest, for the first two and a half years of my business, I did not do personal development. It wasn't until recently that I was like, I gotta do this. Every day, Read it, listen to audiobooks, use success on demand in the Coach Online office. That's what CEO stands for, by the way. Listen to the weekly national wake up calls and the team calls, attend summit and other events. If you're not working on yourself, you're not going to grow. And if you think you don't need to work on yourself, you're going to fail. I can contest that, like, in the two days that I've been doing personal development, I'm reading um, the 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership with the team. 
I can just see a change in myself and be like, ah, like eye opening. You got to do personal development. National wake up calls are like amazing. Like the fact that we get that training for free is unbelievable. You can listen to the callback um, calls. You podcast, podcast addict on Android, you can listen to it on that. On your iPhone, download it, listen on that. If you have like the like little jacks that you have in your car, listen on your way to work. If you take the train, listen to them. Grocery store, listen to them. So many podcasts. The Shalene Show, amazing. I love the little girl, like by little because I mean she's like five two. So many books. Um, Emily has a file in the team page. It has a bunch of personal development books. If you don't know where to start, I highly suggest for like your first, first book, GoPro. The Compound Effect, um, The Power of No, and You Are a Badass. Like Those are probably my top four that I would recommend to start off with. If you're not doing personal development, start doing personal development. Like Reach out to your airplane and be like, where should I start? You got to do it. 10 minutes a day. No excuses. Just do it. All right, let's talk about Success Club because you're going to hear us talk about Success Club. Success Club is like the foundation of your business. Um, I have hit success club for the last, I can't do math for the last 12, 13, 14, 15, 17 months, 17 more months. I have hit success club. Um, we have coaches on our team. Emily, for example, is about to become a success club all-star, meaning she has hit it 12 months in a row. It's non-negotiable success club five every month. And the way we talk about success club is you are helping three to five people every single month. So every month you are looking for three to five people to help change their lives. And you do that with a challenge pack with Shakeology and a workout program together. And I'm pretty sure everybody on this call has started with the challenge pack. So you know the importance of doing the workout and the Shakeology together. It grows your business. Um, it's how you get new coaches. It's how you get new challengers. It's how you get the success stories from the challenge packs. It needs to be non-negotiable. If you are wanting to build your business, it should be a must-have no matter what. I have had coaches that it's the last day of the month, it's 11 o'clock, and they're like, I'm not going to hit success club. Like, I need one more point. I don't have it within me. Like, I'm not going to hit it. And I'm like, just push. Just, like, make it. And they hit it. So what are some of the perks of success club? And I'll talk about how to get success club in just a minute. I think it's on my next slide. No. Okay. So I'll talk about on this slide. Um, how do you get success club by selling challenge packs and Shakeology HD? You get two points for every challenge pack you sell and you get one point for every Shakeology HD you sell. If a coach signs up with a challenge pack, you get two points. If a coach signs up with Shakeology HD, you get one point. So when I say you help three people a month, if you sell three challenge packs a month, you've helped three people. If you want to aim higher, aim for five people to help a month and hit that success club 10. So what are some of the perks of success club? Prizes. So Shalene Johnson bobbleheads, I've got like three of them behind me. I have a Shanti bobblehead, an Autumn Calabrese bobblehead. I missed out on the Tony bobblehead. You can get like things like Beachbody Offaly because who doesn't want a Beachbody Offaly to play on game night? I mean, you're going to be the cool kid with Beachbody Offaly. Um, wear and share. I think last month or maybe it's this month you get like some sort of wear and share. I'm like really, I'm not really 100% sure what it is. Drink cup. In a mug. Yeah, thanks, Emily. She's like giving me signs over here. And you can earn free trips. I went to Cancun last year, all expense paid by Beachbody because I earned enough success club points. I'm going to Jamaica and Haiti. We usually say Jamaica though because Haiti doesn't sound as glamorous. No offense to the Haiti area. Completely paid for by Beachbody. There are coaches on our team that are going on this trip and it's paid by Beachbody because they're hitting success club. Um, so that's Success Club. You hear us talk about it a lot. It does not define your coach business, but it definitely sets that standard and sets you apart from other coaches and be like, I'm serious about this. I'm going to make it happen. Success Starters. Y'all all saw about 16 of us in Nashville last week and you're probably like, dang it, I wish I would have been there. Well, guess what? If you are in your first or second month of Beachbody, you can get your ticket for free. So how do you do it? Say you signed up in June. You did not hit Success Club 5 in June, then you have to hit it July, August, September. If you signed up this month, then you can either hit it July, August, September, or August, September, October. You have to hit it your first three consecutive months as a coach, and you get that little extra month just in case you join up on, like, the 31st because we're not that awful and expect you to go, like, find three challenge packs in, like, the first five minutes of being a coach. 
So what happens if you have success club five your first month as a coach? You get a call, call with Carl. And I don't know if you guys follow Carl. He's like amazing. He's like the bomb.com. We're besties. Not really. We're just friends on Facebook and I find it really cool. Um, second month and third month, I like say awesome sauce because the second month you get your name on the coach online office. And the third month you earn your free ticket to Nashville, which is where summit is. That's where you grow your business. We've had so many coaches, his success club starters. Um, I probably can't name them all. Emily, Brittany, Cara, my husband. I'm looking at my board of names. Brittany, I think I said that name. Layla, Stephanie Parks, Lindsay Sessions, just to name a few. So you can totally do it. You can totally earn your ticket for next year at Nashville, especially because it's sold out. So this is a great way to earn that free ticket. Let's talk about rank advancement. If you are hitting success club, rank will fall into place. I used to, my focus used to be on rank, but my focus is on success club because if you're hitting success club, you will rank up when it's time. So let's talk about rank real quick. There are four different, there's actually five different ranks. Coach, that's what everybody starts off when they're a new coach. If you are active with 50 PV, PV is personal volume. That means if you get Shakeology every month, if you sell something that's at least $50, you're an active coach. So how do you become an Emerald coach? An Emerald coach is like the first stepping stone of your business and it's like, I'm doing this, I'm serious, I'm in. Two coaches, left leg, right leg, that's it. Easy breezy, it could be your mom, it could be your brother, it could be like your spouse, it could be your best friend, it could be anybody. So two coaches, you've hit Emerald, like woo, congratulations, like super excited. Ruby, most people don't usually see Ruby. Ruby is two coaches on each leg. Actually, I think this is wrong. It's three coaches on each leg. I've got my slide wrong. And two of those being Emerald. I think. Am I, right? Am I wrong, Emily? Okay, so four coaches. Four. Okay. It's two coaches on each leg. Regardless, usually you skip Ruby. So it's two coaches on each leg and two of those being Emerald. So this means that your downline's growing, your team's growing. And why do people usually pass Ruby? Because they usually go straight to Diamond. Because Diamond, you need four coaches on each leg, two of those being Emerald. Usually, you're adding new coaches as you're waiting for your coaches to hit Emerald. Sorry, my husband's phone's ringing. Um, no? Okay. So, so we're not super professional in these calls, if you can't tell. So your first focus is to be Emerald. And once you hit Emerald, there was... <laughs> This is why I was waiting, because he's going to start barking and growling, because the phone's super intimidating to a dog, clearly. Mayor, stop it. Mayor! Sorry, guys. So, Emerald, set a goal. I used to say your first 60 days as a coach, strive for Emerald. If you're like, I want to quit my job, I want to make this happen, first 30 days. Once you fit Emerald, go to your upline, find out where your placement of coaches should go, and then we will like talk about it from there. So what is this right leg, left leg thing? Like, obviously we have two walking legs on us, so you're gonna have two legs in the Beachbody business. Your right leg and right left leg is basically, like you just alternate back and forth. Star this, check this, asterisk it, heart it, go to your upline after this call. If you're my coach, person, sponsor, coach, I'll answer you in the morning. Ask your coach what your strong leg is and ask them to talk about the legs just a little bit more so you know for placement for coaches. I won't go into it further like depth right now just because it can kind of be confusing. There is a YouTube video on our team page on YouTube that can give you some more information about it. Um, when you are signing up your new coach, please, 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 please go to your upline coach before you sign up your first coach. Before you sign up your second coach, third coach, fourth coach, go to your upline. It's important because you want to make sure you have them going to the right spot. So when you go into your coach online office, um, you're going to go to your business tab and then you're going to go to preferred placement. And you want to do this after you've talked to your upline and found out your coach, um, your strong leg. You want to hit set preferred placement. Always, always, always hit set preferred placement. Go do this after the call, even if you don't know what your strong leg is. Ignore everything else. And then on the drop down box, you're always going to choose left or right. Nothing else, just left or right. So talk about the back office. The back office is like the holy grail of Beachbody. Like it's your go-to place. So how do you access your coach online office? also known as your COO. You'll see that a lot in the team page. You're going to go to teambeachbody.com and then you're going to go to coach and go to coach online office. You'll see a previous office view and a coach online office. The previous office view is just where you can see orders like right there, right now. So sometimes if you're like super paranoid, you're like, I don't know this person order. Did it go through? Go check your previous coach online office, but mainly pay attention to your coach online office. 
So what are you going to look for in the coach online office? The first thing is your coach ID. Know your coach ID. It's like your social security of Beachbody. So make sure you learn it. The second thing you're going to see, um, you want to pay attention to is your upline sponsor information. That is the coach that you signed up under. Write down their number, save it to your phone, shoot them a text, be like, hey, this is so-and-so. And then you're also going to have your star diamond upline. For almost, for all of you, it's going to be me right now. And you're more than welcome to always shoot me a message if your upline coach isn't available or if you just have a question. Never be afraid to come to me. The other thing you're going to see is so many times, so on the um, left-hand side of your screen, I believe, on the third arrow down, it says, It'll be like, you have 10 new coaches in your organization. I cannot tell you how often people come to me like, I signed up a new coach. I'm like, no, you didn't. Like, congratulations, but it's really just a new coach in your organization. A lot of times you'll see that you have new coaches in your organization, and what that means is coaches have been placed underneath you by other coaches. This is where you'll see that you have new customers, that you have no personally sponsored coaches, that there's new coaches in your organization. In the beginning, there's not going to be a lot of activity in your coach online office, but get into the habit of checking it daily. Can I tell you how many times if someone come to me and like, I'll come to me like, hey, you signed up a coach. They're like, I did. I'm like, yeah, you did five days ago. They're like, oh, I didn't even notice. Check your coach online office every single day. The middle box, you'll see if you've qualified for a success club. Um, once you've hit SC five points, make sure you get your 90 PV. If it says no, that means you have not ordered your Shakeology for the month or whatever you're getting for your 90 HD and you need that for a success club. And then the other thing is coach breaking news. There is a lot of information right now with the boost products coming out, the performance line size, super Saturday summit, just check it daily. Um, usually we try to post the stuff in the team page, but sometimes I'm not quick enough for other coaches. Just get in the habit of check, checking your coach breaking news every single day, once a day, twice a day, at least as long as you're checking it. What are some other things you should do as soon as you um, sign up to become a coach? Go to the start here tab and just go to the three options. The second thing you need to do is go to my website, edit Beachbody coach, and then click on that. That'll take you to where you're going to edit your site. And Emily's about to drop a link in the chat box, and I'll say it out loud as well. I'll get there. <laughs> Emily's like, I am. It'll show you the site that you're going to send customers to, but I want you to use Coach Mobile. Is it coachmobile.teambeachbody.com? Is that it, Emily? Yeah. It's not a mobile app, but we call it the mobile app. You're going to go to it on your phone, and you're going to save it to your home screen. So it's coachmobile.teambeachbody.com. You can set orders up for customers, and this is the only way I set up orders or I set up new coaches. Two things. One, if they give you an email, it's going to pop up that they're already registered underneath another coach. So that's when you are like, are you working with a coach? If they say yes, then they need to go to their coach. Or two, they might have ordered a product like 20 years ago, and they're assigned to a certain random coach. So that way you know that they need a new email to register with, and you're, they're going to go underneath you. You can set up challenge packs. You can set up individual orders. You can stalk the crap out of them when they're ordering. So just save it to your home screen. You can do it from a computer, an iPad, a phone. It's super user-friendly. Like, my dog could do it. Like, that's how you super user-friendly it is. Just kind of get to know it. But at a Beachbody Coach, that's where your site will come up, and that's, like, the link you'll send to people if you don't want to use the Coach Mobile app. So we did the start here. And then the last thing I want you to do is I want you to go to the My Business tab, and then I want you to go to My EFT Management and set up your direct deposit. It takes like 250 out of your check if they have to mail you one and then you have to wait a million years. Like, just do direct deposit. Like, just do it. Do it now because you never know when a random sale will pop up. Let's talk about challenge groups. Hopefully most of you came from a challenge group. If you did not come from a challenge group, get into a challenge group. Um, challenge groups are the building, building block for your business. You should always, always, always be running a challenge group. Why? Because it builds accountability, it builds trust, it builds relationships, it builds support for other people. I have done challenge groups since the day I signed up to become a coach. That's like all I wanted to do. I remember I messaged Lisa in my upline, I'm like, can I start a challenge group? She's like, go for it. And I was like, and I was like, man, I'm only going to have five people join me. And I had like 60 people in my first challenge group. Like talk about nerve wracking, like a new coach. Um, this is my piece of advice, and you can go to your upline and find out what they believe in. I will always do a free challenge group. I will never require a purchase for my challenge group. I have done free challenge groups for the last two and a half years. I have helped many people who I've never made a dime off with, and I'm okay with that because the theme for this year is everyone matters. If I can help someone lose 10, 15, 
20 pounds and they don't go through beach body, that's okay because I've helped them lose the weight. And a lot of times people will come after they've done a free challenge group and they'll come and join beach body. They'll become a coach. They'll find out about the products and they'll join. So I always do free challenge groups. And basically what a free challenge group means is you just don't require them to purchase from you. And I do this because it builds trust and it builds relationships. I keep track of like how much like I've helped people lose weight. And I think in like 2014, I helped people lose over 2000 pounds. Like that's what being a coach is all about is getting people through programs and every day and reaching their goals. Um, there is a team call about challenge groups on our um, YouTube link. It is, and Emily, if you'll type it out for me, it's tinyurl.com slash TFTGF YouTube. So Team Fire to Get Fit YouTube. Yes, where you can find all of our past team calls. So go there, read about challenge groups, um, message your upline, get into a challenge group or co-host a challenge group with another coach. Let's talk about trainings. This is something that's newer to our team. We have three levels of trainings that our leaders on the team help came up with. So when you're a new coach, you're going to get plugged right into the new coach seven-day quick training. It's going to walk you for, through the first seven days of a coach and what you should do. You can take seven days, you can do it. You can take one day to do it. You can take 24 days to do it. However long you want to take to do it, just do it. Self-paced. Then you're going to get plugged into our girl boss training. And if we ever have a guy join our team, then we'll call it like guy boss training also. But right now it's going to be girl boss training. This is a 10-day self-paced training as well. It goes further into depth into different topics like inviting, challenge groups, success club, form, which is like an acronym for something we do. Uh, you will get put into the girl boss as soon as you're done with the seven day quick training and all your information has been sent to your upline. If you've told your upline that your stuff is done and they haven't received your business quick start or your action plan, that's why you haven't gotten to the girl boss training yet. After the girl boss training, you will go into the emerging emeralds group. It is a seven day self-paced training on teaching you on how you can achieve Emerald and how to get there. I love these trainings. When I was around, when I first started, I did not have training. So I'm like super jealous of any new coaches. I'm like, I wish I had these, but I didn't. So you're super lucky that you do. So make sure you're in these trainings. If you're not, message your upline and get into them. Power hour. What is power hour? Power hour is what you should be doing every single day as a coach. It's where you're carving out an hour of your day, even if it's 30 minutes here, 15 minutes here, 15 minutes here. At least an hour a day. If you can do more, great. I try to do like a four-hour power hour just because I do work from home, so I have that ability to do it. So what is it that you should be doing your power hour? I used to have this as the banner on the team page. It is in the photos somewhere. You may have to do some searching for it. I'll try to find it tonight and bump it. Or if somebody else on the call finds it, bump it for me. Um, so I have, this is what I have for our team power hour. This is what I suggest. One, reconnect and build new relationships. You're not talking about beach body. You're just having genuine conversations Two, add three to five new coaches a day, whether our new, I'm sorry, contacts a day, whether it's on Facebook or Instagram. If you're like, I want to quit my job tomorrow, then you want to probably up these by like double or triple. Two, three, invite two to five people to your challenge groups. Two to five messages or three to five directed messages on Instagram. And make sure you're keeping track of these people. Always have a running contact list, whether it's pen and paper, whether it's Excel, whether it's Word, whatever. Just keep a contact list. Four, share the coaching opportunity with one to two people. If you want to make this happen by tomorrow, then up it to three to five people. 10 to 15 people a week, like whatever you need to do to make it happen. Make sure you post on social media at least four to five times a day. Uh, check in on the team page and with your challengers and your challenge groups, look through your messages and do follow-ups. Check the back office, message new customers, connect with your coaches, 10 minutes of personal development, and then check in on the trainings as well as the team page. Um, again, look for this team, this picture and save it, print it out, do whatever you need to do. Modify it to what your needs are. Random additions. Be on the calls. Our calls are every single Thursday, like clockwork, unless something has come up and for whatever reason I can't host it and I can't find another call coach to host it. Every Thursday, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yes, I record them. Yes, sometimes they don't get recorded because technology, you know, it has its flaws. 
but you miss out by not being directly live on the team calls because we have little powwows afterwards. You get to know your fellow coaches. Just be on the team calls. Like I always say, if your boss told you to be at a meeting, would you be at that meeting? Probably. You probably would because you probably would like get in trouble. Now you're not going to get in trouble if you join, join our team calls, but just consider it like a meeting that you have to be at. Do your power hour every single day. Even if you can only get 15 minutes in, prioritize what your power hour. Side note, power hour is not scrolling through Facebook and looking at news feeds because that's not going to grow your business. It's just a waste of time. I, like it is. We can all admit that it is. Do the trainings. Watch the YouTube videos from top coaches. I have so many videos saved on our YouTube channel that are just like golden nuggets of like aha moments, like watch those and check into the team page every day. We're growing. So things are going to move fast. We have a couple different pages. We have like a team accountability page. If you want a fitness page, just check into the team page, see what's going on. And I beg of you, if you see us cheering somebody on for success club, you see a new coach joining the team, just say, Hey, welcome. Because remember when you first signed up and you love getting all those welcoming messages and you felt like you were part of the team, make sure you do that for other people. Here's some link and some resources. So the first one is tinyurl.com slash TFTGF training. This is like a training headquarters. I made it like a year ago. I probably should update it, but it's got so many different um, resources that are available for you. Challenge groups, staying organized, inviting, building, being a leader. Go check it out. It's on my website. If you could not remember this link, just go to fire2getfit.com and then it'll be under, I think it's like training headquarters. The second one is tinyurl.com slash TFTGF YouTube. I talked about it earlier all past team calls, all training videos I've made, summit workshops from 2014, summit workshops from this year. Um, go check it out. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you get notified every time I put up a new video. Third thing is check out the files on the team page. Lots of good resources in there. And then FAQ in the coach online office. When you're a new coach, you're going to have lots of questions. So make sure you're checking out these resources and then go into your coach. The FAQ is like literally where you can find pretty much every answer about products, about coaching, about whatever it is to Beachbody. So make sure you check out those links, save them to your favorites, check them out. So that's all that I have for the team call, I, or the team call. Can you guys tell I'm exhausted? Like, I just wanna fall asleep right now. I'm so sorry, I'm usually not out of it this much. That is the new coach call. I want you guys to, Star your questions, and after this call, go to your upline and be like, hey, I've got some questions. Can we talk? Schedule a call with your upline. If you are a new coach, you should have a new getting started right call with your coach. If you are one of my coaches listening to this call, let's get it scheduled right away now that I'm back from Summit. Um, it's intimidating when you first become a coach, but don't be intimidated. Don't be scared. I always tell new coaches, give it six months. So much can happen in six months. Just think, anybody that opens a new business, you think they're going to like close their shop after a month because they haven't seen growth? No, because that's silly. Like, give it out for six months. Give it out for a year. Like, it's $16 a month. I feel like anybody can invest $16 a month because this business can change your life. It has completely changed my life. I don't know if you guys saw today, but my husband and I just paid off a $7,200 student loan thanks to Beachbody. Like I am paying off debt and I'm only 28 years old and that's like an amazing feeling. I retired at the age of 27 thanks to Beachbody. This business can do amazing things if you give it the chance. If you get discouraged, personal development. Go to your upline. Come to me for a pep talk. Like you can do this. Believe in yourself that you can do this. So I'm going to end it with that. I hope to see you guys on the call on Thursday. We're going to be going over our summit notes. And reach out to your upline, ask any questions, and I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for joining us, guys.